All right, so we have Metroid with 3D Send now. And this is another one of those tier A games. It's really clear now, as I've been playing through these, that there's there's two tiers. There is the standard tier, which is just a normal game that's been had a few 3D elements added to it. Contra kind of falls into that. Mario Brothers kind of falls into that. Adventure Lolo probably falls into that. Then there's this premium tier, and Metroid is in that premium tier, along with Super Mario Brothers and Legend of Zelda. A lot of the Nintendo games, I guess. Excite Bike was in there too. These games have had a significant amount of work done to them, or at least it appears that way, and are just amazing to play. It's something that uh, scratches that nostalgic itch, which I, I think I've said that in one of the videos before, but at the same time feels like something completely novel and completely new. Like you, you have an inclination all of a sudden by playing this to continue playing. You want to, to experience it again. And I think it's because it, it reignites that, that wonderment you had for the game in the first place. So I can't wait to go back through this game now. Again, like many other games, I haven't played this game. This one I've played more recently, probably been about 10 years since I've played through Metroid. Cannot wait to play the rest of the game. Do yourself a favor, sit down, watch this a pretty short video. This one, this one's pretty cool. The effects are very excellent. I will see everybody on the next one. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank <laughs> you.